Dispose of this annoyance at once. Aye, aye, Captain! I can't hear you! <laughs> Just felt like letting that play out. Hey, everybody. Welcome to another fucking uh, thing I'm doing. Trying out, anyway. Hi. So, yes, this is SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. I should also say, uh, for purposes of disclosure, uh, I was applied this game by the marketing folks uh, at, I believe it's Evolve PR. But yeah, I was supplied a copy of this game at request, so thanks to those guys. And I figured, you know, since I'm trying to do more video stuff, might as well get in on this. So yeah, I never played this game originally. I I think this was like around... Around the time I was starting to allow, I, start, I was starting, my parents were starting to allow me to play like M-rated games when I remember. It's been a long time since I thought about this stuff, but yeah, I was a long time SpongeBob fan, never actually played this game. And so I figured, you know, what with the weird resurgence lately of like early to mid 2000s fucking platformers, might as well give this a try. This is my first time booting it up, aside from just like, you know, testing to see if it actually worked. Let's see, how, let's see how this goes. Um, let me actually just... Uh, yeah, sure. Alright. Let's go! Welcome to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today, it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror, wherein our little yellow friend will play the starring role. Big day! I have devised an ingenious plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula! And if Bikini Bottom happens to get demolished in the process, oh well! <laughs> what is With the logic there? Duplicatotron 3000, I know it doesn't exactly make a whole lot of sense to ask, to ask like, hey, what's the logic in this cartoon? Why does he want the formula if not to just sell it and be a better restaurant? Item number one is Plankton a genius. Answer yes. Okay, checklist complete. Throw in the switch. What did you he forgot? He obeyed. Robot army. Hang on. I want to get a photo for my scrap. Oh. Hey, hello. What do you think you're doing? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Wait. Wait. But I'm your master! I made you! No, the good old, I'm a genius. No, oh no! My good China! Also, why does Bikini Bottom look like a fucking Another nightmare? perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah, only I keep getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. <laughs> it's not just any shell. It's my magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick. So we put the toy robots in here. Okay. Then we say the magic wishing words. Stop and looking at me. The magic wishing shell. Okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning we'll have real robots to play with. Stop staring at me. Patrick, aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did. So okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wisna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Schnauzer, but I kept forgetting it. Are you sure this will work? Sure. Last week I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell, then I said the magic wishing word and shook it, and in the morning I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. Good night, SpongeBob. Good night, Patrick. Oh, because it was night. Okay, that makes more sense to me now. 
gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots. I was wondering why, like, the default state of Bikini Bottom was. did you do that? Was like. Some kind of fucking, like, horror movie. Yeah, Gary. It sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. Meow. What a fantastic idea! These signs will provide important tips to help me out. Um, how do I read the signs? Meow. Oh, okay! Press this button to read the signs. Meow. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. Alright, explore the kitchen, explore the bedroom, explore the attic, explore the closet. There's a lot of exploration. I make myself a snack, but there's no time! These are shiny objects. Shiny objects are valu very valuable. We be traded to help SpongeBob along his quest. SpongeBob will need to collect many shiny objects in order to complete his quest to defeat the robot menace. There are five different colors of shiny object. Red, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Red is the most common and the least valuable. Purple is the most rare and therefore the most valuable. More valuable shiny objects are usually harder to find or are in dangerous places. Okay. Standard spinning attacks. Oh! A fucking launcher! Was not expecting that. Okay. Up up the hood. SpongeBob may see how well he's doing pressing RT. Then press number of shiny objects, number of six twenty called spatulas, Patrick's lost socks, and underwear. Because I guess underwear is life. Oh, good. Just repeating the dial. Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. It is really weird seeing like the 3D render of SpongeBob next to its classic 2D render. It was also really weird. Like earlier, I I, I saw that I didn't mention it, but like SpongeBob's like sponginess has the same texture as Patrick's skin. Comic books, you say? Alright, cool. Stuck sign. Presents. It's good that this game is continuing the trend of just needlessly murdering sentient objects. I press B in the air. In the air. Okay, it's bubble bounce attack. Okay, it's a butt stomp. Ya yeah, boy. Launch attack. Okay, good to know what that is. What the fuck? Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Yeah. Yep, I fucked this up. Parts.
Yep. This is where I keep all my old comic books. Oh God, Ooh, shut up. Patrick needs to do laundry. Okay, is that it? So, was all that was up here. I'm gonna say yes. Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. Into the 50 shiny room. Oh my god, go oh, 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 gold spatula. Gold spatula, I need to unlock the areas, bikini bomb special, I need to collect some gold spatula in order to do And away we go into the horrid nether realm that Nothing is. Like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. Why'd you assume that? He's still outside your house. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. Oh, well, you don't deserve it. It's not like you don't deserve it. bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them before they bend all my forks? Nah, fuck your forks. Not the forks! Of course I'll help. But wait. I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Who told you that? The like, golden this is, spatulas, eh? I'm, SpongeBob. If that's the thing I'm worried. That's the thing I'm curious about with this. I'll give you a bucket full of golden Who spatulas. Who is in your dreams? Who is telling You've got a SpongeBob how to do this shit? Like what he needs to do? Is he just like divining it? Hey, SpongeBob! Dead. I just dropped by to give you a bubble hand. Bubble buddy. You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man. But uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah, sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? I, I, I don't uh, fucking know, bro. About new bubble moves. Right. Press this button, and you'll launch yeah, if you think about any of this shit. With bubble power that defeats anything that is directly above you. I already know how to do that. Who's all? Hmm. Come back for those. I don't like it. Oh, yeah, that's not annoying at all. Great. So I activated that button. Are those like. They, those look golden. Alrighty. Great. I feel like a new sponge. It shines. I, 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 I literally just learned that, man. Oh, shit. Alright, come on, you fucker. Okay. Whew. Why was that stressful? SpongeBob, this flapping robot crazy. Oh, fuck you. The what? Crab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more crusty crab. You couldn't get no fucking more... Clancy Brown in? No more fry cooking? 
But because you're gullible, I'm gonna help you out. And of course, make like, a did, small profit in return. Like, why could they, why could they get Clancy Brown in for this? That I'll be got fucking to Tom Kenny. For some of those shiny objects. Oh, this game immediately loses like fucking 10 points. God damn. Clancy Brown is... Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the boundaries. But like, Clancy Brown is so important to that fucking character. How the fuck do you not get him back? And you couldn't even get like a decent Clancy Brown impersonation. That guy wasn't even fucking trying. Like, goddamn, dude. That is. That's almost offensive. Patrick, nice sock. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Oh, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Yeah, why, why does he... Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me... I'll give you a golden turkey baster. You mean spatula? Bless you. Another find for Patrick. Your treasure chest's looking a bit light, boy. Do you think okay. I've got much okay. water on the brain? Three thousand. It's weird that they don't like the dialogue doesn't continue, or the dialogue continues at before the. Uh, like, the dialogue continues before you actually move on to the next text box. Uh, the rolling green hills of Jellyfish Field. Also, why is there no, to like, nature and subtitles in this? Raw, and sometimes a bit tender from the stings. Everybody except Clancy. Ow! Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! I've always been bald, but now I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j j Jellyfish? Well, I guess you're off to scale Spork Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> I'll stay here. Balled up here in excruciating pain. You do that. You do that. Don't worry, Squidward. Fuck. I'll bring God damn it. King Jellyfish Jelly for you to rub all over yourself. I fucking hate it when I like make a stupid joke or like make some fucking ref make some like comment and then the game does it weren't for me. It shines. How's what you fuck off there, bud? I love opening presents. Gear, Patrick. Oh, all gear. Oh, right, yeah. The water underwater. Man, it has been a minute since I've seen any. Since I've actually seen any SpongeBob. Today, I'm going fishing for robots. Fresh like a spring breeze. Mm -hmm. 
I think that'd be another one of those, like, human hand teleport away areas. Yeah, I'm thinking that's probably enough for this one. It's the, the game is very much what you would expect it to be. It is a it's like an old school, let's say old school, but like I said, early to mid 2000s platformer. It's gonna be you run into an area, collect some shit, and then move along. But it seems to be doing it. it seems to be doing it pretty well so far. Like it actually. I'm liking the feel of it. I like the look of it. it they did a very good job, like, uh, remaking this entire, like, remaking the game, making it look modern while still keeping the very weird aesthetic that is SpongeBob. The only problem so far is that there's no fucking Clancy Brown. Goddamn, that is, that is so fucking important to this entire goddamn franchise. That man's fucking voice is goddamn magic. But, I guess, you know, you only do so much. Anyway, yeah, um, the next, the next few days, like, look for a full written review of this from me on the site. Uh, cause if you're watching this YouTube, I have a website, desktopprods.com, where we do a bunch of other shit. Uh, but yeah, uh, until then, I'm dead. Later. Excuse me while I whip this out. Thank <laughs> you.